Hello everyone, I hope you are doing very well. So we are now in a position where we can start looking at the reactions. Now I know what you're looking at right now looks overwhelming, but it's actually going to be a lifesaver, this screen, because in grade 12 organic chemistry, there are 13 main reactions that you need to know, and here they are staring right back at you. What we're going to do in the next couple of videos is we're going to go through each of them one by one and I'm going to help you to familiarize yourselves with them and so you'll see that it's just they're going to you'll see how easy they actually are. So in this lesson we are most likely going to well we're definitely going to do reaction number one and then if there's time we will also do reaction number two. So reaction number one if we look at the diagram, we start with an alkane. Now you know what an alkane is. It's got the carbon and hydrogen single bonds. And we somehow gonna convert it into a halo alkane. So a halo alkane is when you have a halogen. Now if we look at our table, reaction number one is called substitution. I will explain that just now. And the conditions that we're gonna need for this reaction is gonna be UV light. So you typically gonna have to do this outdoors in the sun but I'm going to explain everything now so we're still busy introducing this idea. So we're going to go with an alkane to a halo alkane. So although that table looked or that diagram probably looks very overwhelming we're just going to take it in baby steps. Of course we can't learn it or looking at it all like in one picture but that picture is what we're going to use as our reference and it's also going to be a good thing to know when you're in your exams. So we're going to start off with an alkane and we're going to turn it into a halo alkane. So let me bring out a alkane. So there we have our alkane which is butane which is C4H10 and then we're going to add some HCl to that and we said that the product is going to be a halo alkane and then remember in if you look on the table over here we could see that we needed some UV energy and that's why I've got the sun in the picture and so what's going to happen is it's a substitution reaction so all that happens is that this Cl you can imagine that it will just switch place with this H over here. And that's all that happens. Why it happens, we don't need to know. We just need to know that it happens, okay? So your product then is going to be the following. And so here we can see that the H and the Cl have switched places. And so what would our other product be? Well, well done if you realize that it's going to be the following. We're obviously going to be left off with hydrogen because this H over here gets replaced by this Cl and so we can see the Cl lands up over here. And so this H, let's go this way around, ends up over there. So guys, I'm going to stop there just so you have a nice introduction to the way the reactions are going to work. This is called a substitution reaction because you substitute means to replace. So we replaced this with that. That is all you need to know. So now an alkane can be turned into a halo alkane by using substitution and the way to do it is to make use of UV energy okay and that's why I drew the Sun so there's 13 types of reactions that we are gonna look at but they all follow this type of structure where they'll all make sense trust me as we go through each of them you'll see that it all makes sense thank you for watching